Hi and welcome back to tutorial 45 part 2. Uh, if you're not part of the Markplex email mailing list then please go to markplex.com and sign up for the list there. So if you recall from the last time we were looking at a program that was drawing the high of a period of time specified. So for example you can see it applied to a chart here and if we look at the uh, the settings we're saying we want to use uh, the time start time of 11 and time 1430 and what we were doing is taking that information so we'd find the 11 o'clock bar going over to 1430 which is this bar and whatever the high was during that period that would become the next high that we draw on until the next time that we get to 1430. Now this worked fine but if we uh, change the the settings and let's just change it to a bar that doesn't exist on the 30 minute chart say 1445 what we would find is that we suddenly the thing is not working and if you look here you'll see that plot one is set at zero and the reason for that is that within this program we are using and we're saying if time one bar ago equals end time and that is where we're setting the highest high now because this never happens because th we never have a bar that has got a time of 1445 we have a problem and uh, hence um, hence this program doesn't uh, doesn't work in in that situation so what I want to do is just go to the chart and uh, I'm going to just show you a slight variation on this uh, program and uh, essentially it is exactly the same only this time we're uh, drawing lines on the bars that are within our period so this is um, again looking at bars that we do have times for so it's going from 10 to 1400 so you can see here the uh, the 10 o'clock bar is highlighted 10 1030 and so on right through to 1400 a little bit like pain bars but the way we're doing that if we just look at 14.3 is we're just adding this line here in other words value 1 equals TL new date time low date time high so that's fairly straightforward to do but again we have this problem that we're, we're saying if time or time 1 bar ago equals end time which is just not going to work if there isn't a bar uh, or if for some reason that bar is not uh, doesn't occur on a certain chart for some reason